Slow down for two seconds. Stop! I need to talk to you. So, anyways. We got the sides off. If you guys can hear Cruz, uh, I apologize, which you more than likely can. We're up early, and once Cruz is up, the whole house is up. Um, but anyways, uh-oh, he's down. Get up, shake it off. Shake her off. The big old boots. Anyways, we got the sides off the car this morning. We're up. Like I said, cruise is up. We're up. So um, we got to get this race car clean. Uh, season's over, over for us. So uh, we stripped her down. Going to give her a good old bath. And I'm really, really excited. We have, where'd it go? We have a pit lift. Don't tell me why I got a pit lift at the end of the year, but I did. Man, I've been so excited to get one of those things. And uh, so we're gonna use it today. Use it today, jack this thing up, get a good cleaning. We may just go ahead and put you guys on time lapse or something like that. So uh, yeah. Catherine's making some stickers for a go-kart and Cruz is causing havoc. But anyways, enough talking, we gotta get this thing washed. Come on, you gonna help daddy? Ugh. You gonna help Bubby? <laughs> Watch out. I tell you what, I'll never go without a pit lift again. I mean, that thing is clear off the ground. I've never got completely under this thing. And like, heck, I sprayed the bottom of the car. So, uh, yeah, if you ain't got a pit lift, get you a pit lift. Because I tell you what, that thing helped. Uh, I'm on unlevel ground, so I had to put it down and put a block under the left rear. Because uh, the left rear was still hitting the ground. But other than that... Man, I tell you what, I'll never go to the track without that thing. Check this out. So, my buddy I got this off of, he wired it up somehow to a, a remote. So, don't matter kind of where you are, check this out. Heck yeah. That's what I'm talking about. You just can't beat that. Heck yeah. Need to go back up. Check him out. Yes, sir. Man, I love this thing. I, I think I'm going to wear it out. Uh, but anyways, we're going to wait till she dries and uh, put her on the ground. Push her back inside. And then what we like to do is kind of grease all, uh, not really grease, spray lubricant on all the hymes and stuff like that and uh, really get the water off of it because you just don't want uh, you guys could probably see in the time lapse I come back out with a uh, with a leaf blower uh, usually when I go back inside I'll get the air gun out and uh, spray it off with air hose and uh, really get the get the water off of it don't let the water sit on her and like I said spray them himes with some uh, PV blaster WD-40 or something like that but man I just can't get over this thing I freaking love it. Heck yeah. No more like 
putting it in the garage. I got to jack the back up. Then come up here and jack the front up. And then sometimes the left rear is still on the ground. So then I got to back, go back and jack the back back up. So, man, I love it. Pit lift, for sure. Get you one. So now time for the hard part. Getting that thing in the garage. Uh, we just usually grab the four-wheeler and Catherine hooks up to it and we try to like uh, back her in so uh, we're going to try to get this on camera. Uh, you want to go grab the four-wheeler? Yeah, let me put this on. So this is usually always interesting. We just hook the winch to the back of it and she starts backing up because it's so hard we're on an incline so it's hard to uh, just have two people kind of back her in here so we always have a time with it set you guys up right here and see what we got jesus calm her down calm her down Did he have a yeah Oh yeah. <laughs> Shoot, what'd I do with that thing? Hold up, hold up. Jeez. Hold up. Oh no, oh there it is. Okay. Like it didn't break it. <laughs> All right, you ready? Jeez. Hold up, hold up. <laughs> All right, you can come forward a little bit. All right, back up, back up, back up. <laughs> Tell me we need a bigger garage. Tell me we need a bigger garage without telling me you need a bigger garage. <laughs> yeah, I got her from here. Baby. <laughs> Yeah, that's about perfect right there. Uh, Woo! Alright, we're in. That takes some work right there, but at least... So now that we're about done, Got the car in here, kind of dried off, stuff like that. I just wanted to shoot this real quick. Show these couple of sponsors. Um, appreciation. I know we didn't have a full wrap this year. And uh, just kind of want to sit down and talk about them real quick. And uh, tell you guys maybe what's going on for next year. So next year I think we're going to come out a little later in the season. Um, we just have uh, uh, some stuff going on that's going to put us back a little further. Um, There's actually a couple sponsors that didn't, um, didn't, wasn't put on the car and we're going to make it right for everybody next year. Since we've only raced twice this year, we're going to go ahead and leave all the sponsors that we have on the car for next year don't know if we're going to change the colors up go with the 
a different design or something i'm not sure um leave a comment below if you think we should just go ahead and and uh should we do a different design or should we keep what we got and just wrap the other side um halfway through this season i decided i was going to try to sell everything be done but uh changed my mind and decided to keep everything so that's why there wasn't a full wrap on the car um halfway through the wrap i was like you know what let's let's just i'm gonna just try to sell and uh so we didn't put all the wrap on so um we could just finish putting the wrap on maybe something like that and um i don't know thought about changing it up uh but like i said we're gonna keep we're gonna keep the same sponsors um a buddy of mine chris mitchell uh didn't make it on the car because he was on the other side of the door um so like i said we're gonna make it right for the sponsors and just turn around put them on Devin moran was supposed to be on the nose of the car we didn't get that sticker put on um, but like i said we're working that out uh, with everybody and um we was just taking a break from uh having our having our boy and i think everybody kind of understands that and uh so next year we're just gonna come out a little bit later we had some carb issues and i think we're gonna ship the car back to willie's and uh i'm sure he's gonna get it right freshen it up it's been sitting around with you know fuel in it and stuff so uh we're gonna ship that back and then we're thinking about going ahead taking the motor out of the car this winter and then we'll take it to the dyno just so once we get it back hopefully we can just button it all up slap her down in there and everything's good to roll so that's one thing might be on the agenda this year this winter so uh maybe we can uh make another video of the dyno again this year if if, if we can get to it stuff like that it's just a little harder having the sun now and uh trying to keep up with with doing these videos but like i said the sponsors just wanted to thank them and we're gonna make it right next year for them and uh i don't know maybe we'll come out with a new design maybe we'll just keep this design it's already in the computer and we can just slap her in and call it quits i don't know what we're going to do yet i gotta talk with my my rap lady but uh so uh she you said changed it five times yeah she said that no. i'm uh i think she's gonna put me on the back burner this year so uh but anyways we're just rambling on but maybe maybe we'll you guys will see some uh some dyno videos or dirt bike videos, dirt bike videos some uh i don't know we're gonna i plan on running some dirt bikes this winter indoors um doing stuff like that we still got there might be a couple go-kart races the slider nationals is coming up and also we do a honda hills okay. is supposed to be doing uh something with go-karts and we're thinking about doing that um but i got the go-kart out here now where's that we went up and got it and uh i'm gonna start working on some go-karts because uh we're shut down with this now gotta get this thing figured out over winter and we'll come out swinging next year but until then i think we're going to start working on some go-karts uh at the end of the year it seems like everybody that has a go-kart kind of gets them out this time of year and we start playing around with those so uh maybe we'll put a race on at the house or something i don't know we're just gonna mess around with them get them running but again thank you guys for watching hit the like button subscribe throw a comment in we'll catch you on the next one